from the heart and heartland of this great country. It's Dave Kohler's America. America. Dave uh, Kohler's America is uh, its much like the America that you love. Uh, uh, this is a game we play, uh, and uh, I believe uh, soon to be a uh, there's a pilot in the works at a cable network which we cannot name right now. <laughs> is that right? I'm That's right. Aware. Uh, uh, so Dave Cole's America. Dave uh, takes the uh, USA Today, uh, the nation's newspaper, America's newspaper, and he uh, he picks uh, 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 takes that section that uh, no one reads, the 50 state section, little items about every state. He takes four of those uh, uh, states. Little towns, municipalities, townships. He reads them to us, and then he picks three stories. And the and what we have to do is, of those four cities, towns, municipalities, townships, which applies to the story. It's a game that you can uh, that you can play at home. All right, so let's uh, get the four towns first before we get the three well, stories. First of all, here's the here's the host of Dave. Yeah, Cole, that's me. America. I hear uh, Tony Soprano's going to be playing this game soon in the back room of the Bada Bing with the, with the rest of the guys. <laughs> Well, you know, it's really if, catching on. Yeah, oh, absolutely. If they had more seasons of The Sopranos, I'm sure that's yeah. totally it. Paul, but no, I didn't see that Paducah, Kentucky coming on. But Dave, you're you're, you're stealing your own thunder. I'd like to welcome the the host of, of Dave Kohler's America, Jeff Probst, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> it's good to have you, <laughs> Dave Kohler. All that's right. me. All right, let's and have we'll the start towns. with the four towns today. And don't worry, we'll repeat them in a minute in case you're uh, driving. So, Epson, Epsom with an M. New Hampshire, Epsom, Epsom New, New Hampshire. Hampshire. Oh, sure. Cave Creek, Arizona. Is that two words, Dave? Cave Creek is two words. Cave, Creek. Cave and Creek, Arizona. Okay. Well, if you don't know that, you're already in trouble. Okay. Klamath Falls, Oregon. Say that again. Klamath Falls. Spelling, please. K L A M A T H. Oh, oh, Klamath Falls, Math. Oregon. Oregon. No, we don't have a lot of stories from Oregon. No. And the fourth town in today's game is Wenatchee. Washington, obviously. Wenatchee, Washington. Washington. Oh, it's a very western Dave Kohler's America, Arizona, Oregon, and Washington. It, indeed it is. Uh, Oregon and Washington, where we have a number of good stations there. Whoop, whoop. So you guys are going to know the answers more, uh, hopefully, uh, quicker than we will. And now, Dave, three stories. And now I will read a summary of the three stories that match up with three of those four towns. Story number one, a 44-year-old woman pleaded guilty to manslaughter for stabbing her ex-boyfriend at a mushroom-picking camp. <laughs> well, obviously. Okay. Turns out the ex-boyfriend was engaged to another woman. Mm. Mm. At a mushroom-picking plant. And before... Camp. camp. Oh, sorry, camp. And before she stabbed him, was she wearing diapers or no? <laughs> By the way, my mom wanted to send me to a mushroom picking camp, but I just I did not want to go when I was a kid. <laughs> it's a good call on your part. Because nothing you were worse than the swimming lessons, probably. <laughs> nothing worse than a summer at mushroom picking camp. <laughs> well, apparently it didn't work out for this couple. All right. <laughs> Story number two: School officials locked down three schools after a student reported that someone dressed as Batman had run across the campus of the school, jumped the fence, and disappeared. <laughs> That's awesome. Students were kept inside the school for 45 minutes. Uh, well, I mean, why? Batman would only be there to save them. It's not like he'd be there to cause trouble. Huh, interesting. Okay. All right. And I have to uh, rummage through my well, USA Today here. And story number three, a woman pleaded guilty to starting a forest fire while she was burning pages of her personal diary. Hmm. Diary causes forest fire. Interesting. That seems like that could be just about anywhere. The fire, as opposed to the Batman one, which clearly could only be in one place. Okay. She was burning pages of her personal diary in a fire, started a forest fire that took two months to put, extinguish at the cost of $4.1 million. Hmm, an expensive forest fire. Yeah. All right. So while you guys are thinking about this, I will repeat the four towns and three stories so everyone driving can uh, play along. Epson, New Hampshire, mm -hmm. Cave Creek, Arizona, Klamath Falls, Oregon, and Wenatchee, Washington. And the three stories in the game, real quick. A woman stabbed her boyfriend to death at ex, a mushroom... Ex-boyfriend. Ex-boyfriend at a mushroom-picking camp. 
uh, three schools were locked down for 45 minutes when students reported that a person, or actually Batman, ran across right. the campus. Right, it might not be somebody dressed as right. Batman. Right, it might actually be Batman. And story number three, a woman uh, started a two-month-long forest fire while she was burning her personal diary in a campfire. Oh, I didn't hear that it was two months long. That might change things. Mm -hmm.